everyone, it's Tara again, and welcome to my book corner. This is where I talk about um, books I've read or um, want to read, and I'll talk about it here. Um, so today, the book that I'm talking about today is The Indigo Spell. Um, it's part of the Vampire Academy series by Rochelle Mead. It's the third book in this spinoff series. So if you haven't read it, um, warning, I will spoil some things for you, so you may not want to, um, be on this page. Um, so if you're on this page, I suggest you leave now. <laughs> anyway, yeah. So, the Indigo Spell. Oh my gosh! Yeah. <laughs> what a twist in the story. I mean, I'm glad everything happened the way it happened, but... Wow. <laughs> Rochelle Mean. I mean, wow. Yeah. So, who all, um, who else was a little bit weirded out that, um, Sydney was helping out Miss Terwilliger with all her, um, her spells and, um, trying to find the girls so they would be, um, careful, um, because Mrs. T's, Miss T's, uh, sister was off to kill them. That was crazy. And then the whole uh, the whole fight scene in um, Alicia's house. Oh my gosh, so tense. But I'm glad everything ended up well in there. And Adrian, oh my gosh, and the things that he says to Sydney throughout the entire book. <sighs> I just, like, melted at every single thing he said. It's like, can you get any sweeter than that? And, like, literally, there are times when I wanted to throw my book at Jill. Or, not Jill. At Sydney. Oh, my gosh. But, <laughs> things turned out well. <sighs> so, what did y'all think about Marcus? Marcus, he was not who I expected. I mean... I I knew he was going to be, you know, some big-ish guy in the book, but I never expected that Sydney would want to try to run off with him. Um and who would have thought that she would she would break her um her the golden lily tattoo? I'm like, what are the what are the other alchemists going to do? Do you think they're going to like try to um find her and send her to re-education camp where they sent Keith? Um, and what about Zoe and the other, um, the other damper? I can't think of the guy's name. Was it Daniel or David or something like that? I think they're going to have a big role in the next book, which is Fiery Heart. Comes out next year. <sighs> Do we have to wait so long? No! I feel like I am going to die waiting of anticipation. But I guess we have, um, the movie to look forward to on Valentine's Day next year. <sighs> yes, thank the Lord. Um, um, but anyway, yeah. So Zoe, I think she, um, they're going to have to be careful around her because I have a feeling that she is not going to be one to keep secrets like all the others have been for, uh, Sydney for the past months or however so long that they've been at Amberwood Prep. Um, she's going to go off as soon as she hears something about Adrian and Sydney together and freak out and she's gonna, yeah, rat out her sister. I don't know though, but maybe Sydney will try to, um, get her sister to shut up and stay quiet and she'll do something. I don't know, but I think Zoe has an important role in the next, uh, book. Um, and who is so excited that Sydney finally caved in and, um, went to Adrian. Oh, thank God you lord for that <laughs> anyway yeah that um i was ready to, to smack her when she was about to drive off with Am uh marcus why do we keep wanting to say ambrose boy that's that's not in this series well it is but it's in the vampire academy collection okay anyway yeah i was getting ready to slap her when she was uh, gonna drive off with marcus <sighs> sydney 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 but hey, it worked out, they're together, and I could kiss, I could kiss Adrian, but yeah, he's taken, sadly, um, 
stupid Sydney, right? Anyway, yeah, I'm a little crazy and I just took some painkillers for my teeth because they've really been hurting me lately. Went to the dentist, they gave me something to strap something to take and I'm hyper now and I'm probably gonna crash in like five minutes because they knocked me out. Yeah. So I just wanted to make this video before I forget and I'll probably hate myself in the morning for this. Um yeah, so I'll probably have to want to remake it, but I'm going to post it anyway because I'm hyper and I don't have anything else to do, and it's at night and I'm the only one up. So, yeah, that is my take on the Indigo Spell, but are your all uh, thoughts or opinions, or if you didn't like the way something turned out, tell me or message me or comment on the little comment box down below and I'd like to hear what y'all have to say but yeah I think I'm going to sign off now because I don't have anything else to say and I'm just rambling on and on and on and on and on about this time so yeah good night